I forget what I'm supposed to be doing now. Oh wait, I know. Get cracking some excessive beads. Alice, come here. Can I talk to you for a second? Talk to me, Luther. What's up? It's about my dad. I can't find father anywhere. I know he hasn't exactly been a gentleman lately. I need your help. Any leads? Any clues? Up until the day you put on that play, I seen him hang around some of the nerdies. That's all I got. Sure, bud. I'll help you out. Thanks, Alice. You're the only honest person left around here. Hmm, guess I'm back to John board. Now, where's the plot? Ruth Thor's mentioned something about nerdies. And, really, that's only me to talk to the rep master who's not here. Great to see you. So I hear you've been hanging with Dad B. Where is he? Hmm. We're not exactly hanging, as you would so roughly put it. We've been engaged in a mutually beneficial co co-potent dialogue. Just tell it to me straight, sister. I'm so sorry, but you and I don't have the sort of rapport, as you say, relationship that would compel me to delude secret information. Huh? Impress me, Alice. Show me that you're a person with integrity. Since you get to relationship 30, I'm mean not 30, 70. So, Polly, my newest, dearest friend, what? what's with you and Daddy Big Bucks? If you must know, he contracted me to oversee the construction of a high tech astrophysics lamp toy. Why a lamp toy? I'm not so sure what sort of experiments Daddy B is planning to carry out. I hope it only because he has healthy interest in learning. Can you tell me where this lab is located? Hmm. I shouldn't tell you, but I am certain a I'm certain able. It's behind a not so secret door somewhere in his office. Well I need a key of some kind. No, the doors open between 3 a.m. and 4 a.m. It's a security glitch I mean to fix. Daddy keeps moving us to it, so you'll have to look around. Thanks, Polly. No problem. Well, not yet, anyway. Of course he'll put his secret lamp in his office. No one ever goes there. There's no reason to. Uh, I'll take shortcuts. Now you can actually go in here at any time during the day. It's just that if you go at any other time, you'll get caught and go to jail. Let's see, might as well have a look around. Oh look, secret documents. Now on the other side, you can find some excess beads and a very big cage. It's about the size you need for a human. For a human cat. Come here, Teddy, Spectral. Who's Teddy? Teddy's a bell Teddy's inside, a your bell head. inside your head. He only wants to hurt. Only wants to... Phone. Now, where would a Luther be? I'm always surprised that these are actual phones and not just decorations. Hello. I'll be floating around the moon crater for quite a while.
This is whack, man. You found these in a secret lab? What the heck is Fonth up to? He has some explaining to do. Not so hasty, Lethal. We have to be secret about this. Well, man, listen to me. I'm shutting down the lab so Fonth can't pull any funny tricks. Okay, but be careful. Hey, it's me, dude. I'm Lucifer Big Bucks. Chill. The plot thickens somewhat, maybe?